Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Alcoholic Phoenix here and welcome to Subsistence episode number 58. We've got uh, some boys rolling up on us. Luckily I was just creating some ammo and some healing kits. Hit him right in the chest. Okay, we should be good. We'll have a healing kit ready in a sec, which is what I'm waiting on. Really? Got him. Got bandages. We got med kits. Oh shit, they threw an A. Where'd it land? Oh, you fucking bitch. Hit me from there, boy. I don't have a good view of him. Come on, you fuck. Okay. Fuck did he go? Did he run? Will they do that if they get their ass kicked? Will he just run? The fuck did he go? Did he just take his shit and leave? Or did he die? Did he bleed out? Maybe? Did he bleed out? Maybe? Maybe not? No, it just seems like he straight up just left. Strange. Well, that kind of fucked up my plans for today. I was trying to gear up because I wanted to head over to the hunter base on the hill because I wanted to raid him because we need a lot of stuff. And then this asshole and his friend had to come fuck it up. God damn it. At least if I killed both of them, I would have felt fine with it, but I only got one of them. Seems like a lot of ammo wasted in that for one dude. Okay, guys and girls, we're heading over. We're going to try this. I don't know how we're going to go. Um, we could get absolutely pooped on. I do roughly know what kind of gear uh, I'm expecting them to have on. Pretty sure two of them have helmets. One of them does not. Sounds like they already know where I am. Not. Are you kidding me? He knows now. Fuck. Got one. Well, he shot his teammate. Got another one. Got 
Got them all. Stop the bleeding. Alright, this better be worth it, man. Alright, so far so good. Okay, now. I wanted to make sure I didn't have the grenade on my body when I raided them, uh, or when I, you know, went to go fight them. Because I kind of figured if I died, I'm probably going to end up losing that out of my inventory. So I left the grenade at home, so that's what we're going back to get right now. I'm probably going to drop all the guns and all the other stuff off. Um, so we don't lose any of that. And then we're going to go over, just with the pickaxe, nade the door, and then, you know, beat the shit out of it for the next five minutes like I normally do. Okay, let's... Uh, nope. That. Nope. This. This, that. That. This, that, this. We'll go bang, 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 bang. Bang. Take that with us. Okay. We should be okay, though. Oh, wait. We're gonna get the grenade, you idiot. My god. Dumbass ahoy. Hopefully not fuck up this nade placement. If I can do this right, we could get a lot of loot here. It's been a little while since I've raided these guys now. So their loot should have built back up over time by now. I'm just a little bit worried about what that bear's gonna do. Of course he's walking up there. He couldn't have done that before I raided him or something and maybe killed off one or two of them. For me, that would have been helpful. No, he's gonna go up there now when I want to be up there nading the fucking doorway. That is always the way. But, I do think Cold Games needs to kind of randomize the... the hunter's aim a little bit. Because sometimes it's just way too accurate. Like, 99% of the time. It hits me and it's like, no. Especially in situations where the the hunters aren't even looking at me and they somehow like side corner shoot me in the fucking head While they're facing a completely different direction that just pisses me off Now let's see if we can sit this right in the doorway crease Okay That is as close as you will possibly get and it still takes half off all right I'm going to start beating on this door, see you guys and girls in a moment. This bear is getting a little too close for comfort sometimes. He keeps coming up to the tree, like sniffing really close to me and then fucking walking away. And it's making me super paranoid. So I'm just like sitting here doing this repetitively, just looking over into the corner of my eye to keep an eye on the bear. But we're nearly done breaking down this door anywho. We should get some decent stuff out of here. I'm fucking hoping so, anyway. I'll be really pissed if we've broken down this door for shit all. One. Bang. Okay, here we go. Nice. Holy mamosita. I don't like how they space it out, so it looks always looks like more than what there is. Although, there's like... 100 gunpowder here which is dope plus two grenades bunch of ended fat make sure we got everything from that nothing in there nothing in there nothing in there stuck here apparently there's pine log written in the middle of my screen for some reason Wow, I'm a little disappointed. They didn't have, like, a workbench or anything? They don't have a workbench? Fucking kind of shitty hunters are these. They don't even have a fucking workbench, dude. They've been here since the start of the fucking game. That just surprises me that they don't have a workbench. That really does. We did get a shit ton of gunpowder, though, which is fucking awesome. If only we could get some fucking sinew. Sinew, sinew, senyo, however you want to say it. 
then we'd be set. I have everything else I need, including the padded cloth, to go ahead and make ourselves another vest. But I just, I'm one rope short. One singular, one singular rope short. I probably got enough for a full uh, set of shotgun ammo. I mean, we could go all the way over and kill a cougar, but it's all the way on the other side of the map. We've only got a couple minutes left in this episode. I mean, I don't even know whether I've got enough daylight to make it over there and back before it gets dark. I probably don't. So that's part of the reason why I don't want to go over there right now. We will make the combat vest in the, the next episode, though, for sure. But I think that was worthwhile. We did get some pretty good stuff out of that. I'm really happy about the gunpowder. Probably the thing I'm happiest about, to be honest. Do that. All the stuff that goes in here we'll do first. Um... Then this stuff we'll do next. Oops. Yeah, so I even made the alloy sheets as well. Like, I went ahead and did that as well, and... I still... Still needed that sinew. Okay. There we go. Wait, no. We want to end this one. There we go. Beautiful. Fantastic. Got everything. Yeah, we do have a full set of shotgun ammo. Hmm, yes, definitely gonna do that next episode. We'll probably get raided next episode, if I'm being honest. I've fucking been messing with hunters quite a lot the last couple episodes. Like, multiple in an episode. So I wouldn't be surprised if we get raided by multiple fucking factions tomorrow. And I just get my shit pushed in. But anyway, guys and girls, that is gonna be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more subsistence in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, poise.